only uh, season low in points. What do you think was the offensive problem tonight? Uh, well, you know, 12 for 48 from three. Um, we, the ball, the ball's got to go in. You know, win the game, you've got to make some shots. So they, I thought they did a really good job on, on Steph. You know, uh, they just kept five along the whole game. And he harassed him really well. And they sent, uh, sent some doubles. And, uh, we just couldn't uh, make them pay enough um, for uh, for paying so much attention to Steph. We had some some decent looks. Uh, I'll watch the tape and see what we could do better. But uh, I think Doc's the one who made up the term make or miss lead. Um, it's kind of the truth. Like, you got to make shots, and tonight we just couldn't make shots. We talked recently about just how many of Steph's shots this season are from three, not from two. I mean, would you uh, – tonight, again, I mean, it's very overloaded with threes. Would you like to see him try to maybe use the mid-range, get to the rim more? Could that counteract some of this pressure? I thought he uh, he did that in the first half quite a bit. He, he uh, got to the rim a couple times. Uh, he, was, he was patient, uh, had a couple mid-rangers. Uh, but, again, I give uh, Bible credit. I thought he was fantastic defensively. You know, he's uh, a rare – combination, you know, of, of uh, length and athleticism and, and brains, and um, he, he did as, as good a job on Steph as anybody I've seen in a long time. Steve, the missed shots notwithstanding, he made some in the third quarter, got a 13-point yeah. lead. What, what changed that, like, the third quarter on the fourth to turn us active? Just couldn't sustain it. You know, we uh, – so it was a, a little bit of a strange game just with the foul trouble. You know, Draymond picked up uh, – the, the fourth foul, so we decided to let Steph run, you know, th through the most of the third quarter, uh, just because we didn't want both of them off the floor, and uh, we hung in there pretty well. But when Steph uh, went off the floor at the whatever it was two three minute mark, um, I think we lost most of the lead at that point. So uh, our rotations got a little little messed up with the foul trouble and. Uh, just uh, couldn't get the ball to, to go in the basket. Couldn't um, sustain that lead. The step, it's volume and efficiency. Right? The efficiency hasn't been there as much the last couple games. Do you get a sense that he's pressing at all, or is it defensive uh, adjustments of everything? Uh, tonight, I thought it was um, it was more uh, the defense that he was facing than, than anything. Uh, you know, teams are going to commit everything to, to keep Steph from uh, from going. And uh, that's what Philadelphia did tonight. And as I said, they've got a guy who they can uh, put on him who's pretty tough to uh, to shake. So um, they, did, they did a hell of a job defensively. They, they earned it. And uh, you know, we just got to bounce back. You mentioned the foul trouble. Draymond had to sit in different parts of the game. Looney, and Looney was out in some of those pockets, I think. When Bielitsa was on the floor, you guys were minus something like 20. It did I know this is a particular matchup for it, but did maybe your lack of center depth you feel like show tonight? Uh, no, I, I mean, you know, Looney was great. Um, you know, Draymond was 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 really solid. I thought uh, thought we did a pretty good job on Embiid for the most part, but this is a very unique matchup. Um, you know, Joel is a Obviously, a really talented player, but uh, an old school center in a lot of ways, just his ability to score in the paint and dominate physically. Uh, so I thought I thought we did you know as good a job on him as we could have. Uh, we got to the line a few more times than we would have liked. But, uh, battle of hard, we just uh, couldn't score enough. That was the main thing. I mean, if we hold teams to 102 and 46 percent from the field and 33 from three, we we usually win that game. So. Uh, it's more, more about our offense and our defense. Okay. Belly's on a bit of a cold snap, uh, two shooting lines. What do you, what do you attribute that to? Uh, you know, long season, and uh, it's uh, that's how the the year goes. You know, even for a great shooter like Belly, um, you know, there's going to be spells where uh, you're not feeling it quite as much, and he'll, he'll bounce back. Do you sense a hesitancy from him when he gets the ball? Uh, yeah, I saw a couple couple plays tonight where he hesitated a little bit, uh, and uh, we want him to be aggressive. We want him to, to let that thing go, and, and uh, 
very confident in him. He's been doing this a long time, been in the league for uh, many, many years, and shot it at a high high level. And, uh, he's uh, he's helped us win a lot of games already this year. He'll bounce back. Obviously, you're only busy here, but did you feel any extra electricity in the building given staff of the record? It seemed yeah, like it was great, great atmosphere. This is one of my favorite uh, arenas to play in, just because you can feel the love for basketball in Philadelphia. Um, Sixer fans have a, there's just a lot of history here, a lot of emotion, and uh, it's always a, a treat to come here and play, you know, once a year. I'm sorry. Andre, how do you think he looked after us? Yeah, he struggled. Uh, you know, it's been a month or so since uh, since he played, and obviously just trying to get his, his uh, legs underneath him. Uh, so it wasn't Andre's best night, but uh, he'll you know he'll he'll bounce back. He just needs to get some some reps and some rhythm. We talked about this a little bit last night. What goes in as a staff as far as veterans on the back to back coming up in the end of your plays? Who does what? What goes in? What the, goes into the, the rotation? The, 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 the decision on who might sit, who might play uh, in the end of your um, yeah, I mean, we look at matchups. We uh, we make you know, adjustments during games, like we did tonight when there's foul trouble. Um, you know, we we try to find combinations. We we like certain combinations. So, so every game is a little different, but uh, we have confidence in, in everybody on our roster. Uh, you know, tonight was a night where we were searching, um, trying to find a combination, especially in that second half that uh, that clicked and. You know, other than that one run when we went up 13, we just couldn't really get uh, get any momentum and and find a lineup that really uh, worked. We were searching and we just couldn't uh, couldn't get there. Yeah, I mean, sitting who's going to play Monday or Tuesday is all. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure that out tomorrow. Yeah. Is that it. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks, Steve. Steve. Congratulations on USA. Man. Thank you. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs>